unique. She's beauty, she's grace, she's Miss Coffee. Uh, I'm stuck with this kid for three more days. Go home, Roger. <laughs> they love me and I love my coffee. Put some salt in there. Hey! What is for breakfast today, ladies and gentlemen? Deviled eggs and... From the devil himself. Uh, yogurt. Breakfast potatoes. Yummy, yeah, we made a little Aldi run. We got a bunch of goodies. So excited. I'm sad, I only oh, have two more days okay. left. Okay, well, the rosemary just spilled everywhere. So before breakfast, we're all gonna read the word of God together. What should we read today, guys? Continue in the book of John, where we left off. Okay. We were now at John 13, uh, Jesus washes the disciples' feet. Now before the feast of the Passover, when Jesus knew that his hour had come to depart out of the world. Look at that freaking huge boat. Whoa, what the fart is that? Y'all look at this. It's like weird looking. Hey, but you see this boat? Mm. Shall we continue? Yes. Then he poured water into a basin and began to wash his disciples' feet to wipe them with the towel that was wrapped around him. Oh. Welcome to my kitchen. <laughs> wow. Hello, vineyard area of Germany. Oh, yeah, we're trying to find a wine tasting here, but we're having no luck. Hello, anyone got some wine for us? Man, look at this. Okay. Oh, yeah. It's this is stunning. Worldwide. Imagine driving on that. Oh, you guys, I don't want to go home. So we are now at this beautiful vineyard, and my dad recommended us to get this one bottle called Riesling. I think it's called Spätlese. Uh, late. There's some bottle called Spät something that my dad recommended us to get. So we went to this lady. She didn't speak very much English, but we spoke with her as best as we could, got the bottle of wine. Now we're just gonna chill here for a little bit. The weather's beautiful. I'm gonna take some pictures. I'm really excited. You guys, I don't wanna go home. But I think we're gonna try and cruise down to Switzerland today, cause tomorrow we're gonna try and explore that tomorrow morning and then go back to Munich and then go home. Wednesday morning, the 27th. I'm sad. Guys, we made some friends. Hello. And there's more, there's three more coming over here. Hello, guys. Angela here. There's Janie in the back seat, feeling nice, warm, and snuggled up. There's Dustin. Howdy. Um, Janine and I are still drinking some vino, <laughs> and poor Dustin has to drive, so he had to stop. But we've got the music jumping. Tell them where we're going bumping. now. Bumping. We are heading to Zurich, and it's about a five and a half hour drive, so we've got a little ways to go. Yeah. We're gonna try to watch some Netflix and movies while we drive, yeah, so chill. we don't get too bored. Um, all right, here we go. Cheers. Dustin's just been admiring this car for like 10 minutes straight. Oh my gosh, y'all, this is stunning. <gasps> ah! It's so pretty. <laughs> this guy, <laughs> this guy just drove by and stared at me and goes, as he was driving by. <laughs> There's Angela and Dustin being annoying on the other side of the river. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at the sunset. Beautiful. God, what is this? Are they are they knitting it right now? Yeah, they're doing hand arm knitting. What in the world? We're just walking through town. Everything is absolutely closed. But it's beautiful and it's so clean. That's what we noticed about Germany and um, Switzerland. Is it so clean? Angela hates these stairs. Oh my gosh, why is the handle bar so low? <laughs> if I were a kid, I'd be terrified of this, but now I'm not anymore. I mean, at least I can see that the ground is only like. Uh, it's cool. I found good lighting, so I'm taking advantage of it. <laughs> the weather is absolutely perfect, you guys. This makes you want to just sit outside, drink a glass of wine, or a nice sparkling water and just enjoy Switzerland. It's beautiful, you guys. Okay. What the 
Why did he just do that? What? Why that was weird. I was like, I gave him my hand and then he tried pulling me closer. You guys just, I walked with this guy and he goes, hi, and I go, hi, he goes, hand. I gave him my hand and then he tried giving me a hug. I wish I didn't stop recording because I was freaking weird. Good morning, guys. I just woke up. It's like 8 a.m. right now. Today is my last day in Europe. So we're in Switzerland right now. We're in Zurich, Switzerland. This is where we camped tonight. In the woods, it was so nice. It's lovely, you can hear the birds chirping, and yeah, it's just really pretty. The weather's really nice right now. It's a little chilly, but still super nice. So yeah, we're about to make some breakfast and then go explore Zurich even more. Last night was super fun. We got to explore and see the town at night, but today we're gonna see the town during the day. I'm super excited. I'm still in my pajamas because we're about to make some breakfast. I don't want to go home, but I'm also kind of like ready to get back to, you know, work and uploading and doing all that stuff, working out, but I won't. I'm also like, no, I love it here. Y'all, our last bikes of the trip, for at least for me. This company's so, dope. You can rent these for free if you just put a, how much deposit? So it's a 20 Swiss franc deposit, but in the world's most expensive city, it's amazing, there's free bikes. These are freaking free. Definitely check these out if you come to Switzerland. So as long as you return the bikes back before 9.30, then you get your money back, which is a great deal. Today's first stop, this beautiful view, you guys. Switzerland is unreal. All I want to do is just jump in this water so badly. Yeah. Now this is how you do a successful bike ride. Got your jam. Heck yeah. And also we've already biked so far 2.23 miles and I started this really really late. So we probably already biked about 6 miles today. Yo. We've waited long enough. We're eager to jump in the water. I think it's going to be a little bit cold but we don't really care. We're just going to do it. Here's today's bikini. This is the one from lulus.com. I'm so excited to jump in. I'm gonna try and get some really cool shots. Oh, this place is incredible. Currently picnicking over here. So This is out. the freaking life. The apples, bananas, hummus. avocado, hummus, these delicious Jeez. crackers. So good. But oh. no Nutella. And the water just came up because a boat drove by and got all of our towels wet. I, oh my gosh, you guys. I thought Amsterdam was my favorite. This place is my favorite so far. Gorgeous, beautiful weather, water. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe it. Great. I smell chocolate and we followed the smell and now we are at the largest chocolate place. Mm -hmm. I just have to and go. Just, just walked. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. These are the, oh, it's these chocolates? Yeah. This is heaven. Yes, lemon, please. What's <laughs> up? Yo, I backed up the hill so fast that I'm sweating. It was like a soul cycle quest all over again. <laughs> that little dog's about to jump up and eat her drone as soon as it lands. So Janine is practicing flying her drone for the first time ever. We're at Lake Zurich and she almost dropped or flew her drone into the lake. It landed like one foot away from the water. <laughs> so I think my trip has come to an end. I'm so sad. I just swam in that beautiful water. Oh my gosh, it, I feel so alive when I swim in there. And I flew my drone, which I have not flown this whole trip. It's my first time flying it. I think it went okay, almost went fresh in the water. But yeah, I have to head back to Munich tonight. It's a pretty far drive, and then back home. Oh, it's been such a fun trip. Knock, knock. Anyone home? Hola. No, wait. <laughs> Look at our view before we leave. It's so pretty. It's our last dinner in the van, well, at least for me. We made chili tonight. To Morning, everybody. I'm on my way to the airport. We just got here. It's super early. We all had to wake up at 6 a.m. to go to the airport. Um, my flight's at 10.35. I'm going to London and then from London to Dallas and then tomorrow morning I will be going back to LA. Lots of traveling, um, but yeah, this trip was amazing. I'm so sad to leave. Bye! <laughs> and we're back. Oh my gosh, look at this line. Bye, Germany. 
actually so sad. I'm at the London Airport after being screened 50 billion times for you guys well knowing me and my experience and luck. But I'm finally heading back to Dallas and then tomorrow I will be going back to LA. I'm so excited to get back to working out and filming and just the routine of things. But I've had so much fun here you guys, so much. I'm back and it's so hot because I landed in Texas first. And I'm looking for my parents. I'm so jet lagged. Hey guys, good morning. Welcome back. I'm back in Dallas. I landed here and then my parents picked me up from the airport and I completely caught up with them on my whole trip and got to see them and everything. And I didn't vlog because um, my jet lag, you guys, is so bad. So like they came and picked me up back at my house here in Dallas. And on the whole the whole time they were talking to me, my eyes were just like shutting because like basically 3 a.m. for me when I landed back in Dallas. Anyway, so um, caught up with my parents, went to bed pretty early, and then edited, and just my whole sleep schedule is jacked up. I have like the biggest headache because of like the jet lag. It's super weird. Um, so I'm gonna be here in Dallas for just today now. I'm leaving back to LA at 8.30 tonight. And so um, I'm going to get my nails fixed because they're outgrown and one of them chipped. Just pack and then I have a couple of videos to edit. I'm trying to do the um, Instagram followers control my day video. I'm trying to get that up. And yeah, so I was literally just here for a little bit and I'm flying back to LA today. Um, but if you made it to the end of all my Europe vlogs, thank you guys so much. I truly think that trip was one of my most favorite trips I've ever taken. Um, it was so just relaxing and being with family makes a big difference when you travel with family. And oh my gosh, it just made me appreciate my culture and my family and just, oh, I loved it so much, you guys. So thank you if you joined me on all the vlogs. If you did, let me know in the comments down below. Let me know what was your favorite destination. I love you guys. Thank you for allowing me to pursue my dreams. I will catch you guys back in LA for a lot more adventures and back to the daily lifestyle because I have to get back to working out and eating healthy after that trip. So see you guys back in LA. Peace out, Girl Scout. Bye.